Hey guys and gals, this is Army Mech One, aka Michelle. I'm here with a revenge raid against Romer X612. Now this base was huge. Uh, it had a total of 39 chests, three safes, nope, four safes, uh, and four 1,000 hit point turrets. Now, I'll tell you this, finding those turrets and getting inside and killing them all was not worth it. They were protecting junk. Uh, obviously, we can't get in the safes right now, but uh, I definitely wanted to let you know that not worth breaking into. Avoid the turrets. I mean, there is a gun room that's protected by a turret. You just got to do a little fancy footwork, but I'm not going for guns this time because I found some pretty awesome stuff. Um, normally, I don't clear data or anything like that, but I wanted to see what all the space had, and it was totally worth it. So, let's see. We're going to start... And we'll go to this one first. Now be careful, there is a window. If you stand in front of that window, that turret will get you. We're going to take you. And you. Maybe you. We'll see. Oh, I forgot. I forgot about these guys. Ah, let me out, let me out, let me out. Okay. Now we can stop and plug them. Now, this base only had three uh, spike traps, and they were broken. He never repaired his spike traps, so you will need guns to do this. Or melee weapons. You can raid with melee. I'm choosing not to because I'm lazy and don't like my whole set of gear to break. Okay. So, the next one. Is this one? And ta da! Pretty shiny, yay! Very pretty, very nice in here. Did that set off the next set? Nope. Okay. Yes, it did. Ah, I see him coming. They had a while to come in. <clears throat> Let me out! No! Ring around the rosy! Get away! Get away! Alright. Now I got some distance. Kinda. <laughs> oh, I miss my spike traps. See, those are the three spike traps, and they're broken. Bad base person. Bad roamer X. And there was a... There was a... a weapon rack in that corner, but it's empty. Don't waste your time if you don't see any guns on it. Hmm... We'll pop a first aid kit, sure. Okay. This is my lovely scuba mask. All these reputation items. You know how long it takes to get this much reputation. You're talking about lots of guns on hard mode trying to clear this. Okay. I want those cameras to... But first, we're going to load up the chopper with stuff we're going to keep. I need that C4 for this next part. This is a revenge raid, so it doesn't cost me anything. But we are going to sort stuff out, so I kind of prioritize stuff. We want that and that and that, like so. That way I can decide what I want to get, keep and what I want to get rid of at the end. OK, 
cameras. Um, maybe that. No, I want the oil instead. I want the oil. Yeah. But we're we're obviously gonna have to make decisions. It'll be decision time soon. Because I'm gonna come up here and I gotta go seven over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Actually, I could have done it from the inside. I don't need to chop an extra wall. Actually, yes, I... No, I don't. I can go in the long way. I gotta be careful because this is gonna stick me. All those turrets. Don't, don't get shot. This is gonna stick me in a hard to get out of spot. I'm not going to spawn the big one for this raid. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Below this wall. Puts me at 69 noise. And... You got a lot of chopper patterns. I'm thinking I want to take those uh, two Christmas 17 patterns, but I I don't really have the spots for them. Hmm. I'll probably give up my my hatchets. I need to choppy choppy this, cause. Ah, uh, get out of there. Get out of there. Wish she had some windows. See, there's is there's nothing on that. So don't take it. Don't break it. it. Don't shake it till you break it. Get out of that. You don't want to get blocked in. Being blocked in sucks. And just keep moving. Get those big ones further away from you. Shoot, run. I really wish he had some spike traps. I would totally be taking them out right now. And like I said, this guy has guns. But there's things that I want more than guns. And you're like, what? But you saw the other stuff I got. The reputation items. Steel bars, steel plates, aluminum bars, aluminum plates, all that good stuff. Well, I'm about to show you what else I'm going to take. Okay, well, I'm going to put the carrots in there. That gives me another slot. No, don't chop that. Bad army mech. Don't do it. Like I said, huge base. Oh, and I forgot I didn't get in that way. Let's run around the base one more time. Now, I'd really like your feedback, guys. Do you prefer me mapping out a whole big base like this and giving you the map and what's in there? Oh, by the way, generator, we're going to take that home with us. Do you prefer the map provided to you in the loot tables and stuff? Or do you want to be surprised? Do you want me to be surprised? I don't know. Something like this, I, I really want to know what y'all like to see. I don't know how to do one of those polls on YouTube. That'd be great information to... If y'all know how to make a poll on YouTube, that'd be nice. Please let me know. Let's see. So not that this is what I wanted right here. The gas. We'll probably take those Christmas 17 patterns. Let's see. What else was there? That was two. Was there anything else in that one? No, I didn't care about that. The gas I always care about because I'm not spending money on that stuff. One last chest for me. 
this is what I want. And note, I've got 85 noise right now. Four engine parts? And you know, yeah, that's great, an electronic circuit, woohoo! But I'm really interested in that 18 white paint right there. White paint is the hardest paint to collect. I have like full boxes almost of every other color. And I have like eight or nine white paint, I think. That's double the paint I've collected so far in game. And I've been playing since January. So if you're looking for something rare in the game, white paint is rarer than lenses. It is seriously hard to get. So just a heads up, that's that. You know what? This has six wrenches and there's more wrenches in the other boxes. And I'm going to take a stack of red and yellow because the others are easy to come by. Heat sensors, I've got almost as much as this guy does, I think. And other than using them for turrets, I have no other purpose for them. So I'm going to leave them behind. If you're looking for guns, you can blow this wall. In here, the first chest you'll come across will be two flare guns. Next to it, a SCAR, a VSS, a Colt, a rifle... Um, first aid kits, next to that, two AKs. This one had two and a half sets of SWAT, and they were full, along with five sets of tactical. Uh, this one had only a SWAT helmet, 40 first aid, 10 band-aids. Um, and then next to that one is a full chest, a Level 2 full chest of full SWAT. So just a, a heads up. If you're looking for that stuff, that's where you find it. Now there's even more further in. Like I said, I'm going to figure out how to edit in a picture of the map I made along with the loot tables. Now if you blow this door and go down to this end behind that meat dryer, there is a chest with like 40 raw turkeys and 60 raw meat. And let me tell you, it was heartbreaking to make that decision. Do I want this white paint, four engine parts, a circuit board, gas, you know, uh, that stuff compared to the other stuff. But that's what I went with. I hope this was helpful. If it was, please hit the like and subscribe button along with in the notification bell for any future updates. I'm showing you all my loot that I've got. There's a generator on the back. Got that. Got a scuba mask, lots of reputation items, lots of high level metals, some really good stuff. Oh, I can take something else. Oh, what do I take? What do I take? Is there something else in here that I wanted? Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna take maybe gold bars. Or I could take eight Zulu cards. Those are rarer than the gold bars. You can only get Zulu cards from raiding or killing the blind one. I personally killed the blind one once, and that was enough for me. Everything else, Zulu card-wise, I've stolen from other bases. So yeah, that's what I got. If you like it, please say hi and let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. Bye! Hey guys and gals, this is... Player Romer X612 LDOE 1.9.4. I mapped out his base. The keys to the wall map and the items are there. The yellow highlighted boxes are the ones that I was personally interested in. And I'm going to show you the loop tables now. So
I have the front and back. I hope y'all can read my handwriting because I'm too lazy to type it out. But I highlighted everything yellow, obviously, to match those boxes, why they're interesting. And pink for the other boxes. The other side. I should have highlighted 25 as well, just because it has 60 raw meat and 40 raw turkeys, along with some other good stuff. Just realize you got to decide which walls you're going to knock down because that map I showed you, you're going to be breaking two, two stone brick walls if you're going to get more stuff than what you want. So, anyways, I will see if I can splice this all together yet again. Here is the map of Romer X612. And I'm trying to figure out a way to do this on the computer so it's not so messy. But hopefully this is helpful. Thanks for watching. Bye!